Hello friends, welcome to my channel, and here I gonna show you the straightforward tips and settings for AirPods on Mac and MacBook. Customize AirPods settings also manage output and input control. Follow the video till the end to know all about connectivity fix and customizations on output volume, audio balance, and quick control AirPods from Mac OS Control Center. I assume that you are connecting your AirPods with Mac the very first time. To pair your AirPods on Mac, puth both the AirPods into charging case, then keep your AirPods case lit open. Now, press and hold on the back button of the charging case until your AirPods amber light flashing out. That means AirPods is resetting. If you won't reset AirPods then clean up the AirPods connector and try again, here's my video. On your Mac, go to the Apple logo from the top Mac menu, and click on the System Preferences option. And open Bluetooth Preference, and then here's your AirPods in the list. My AirPods Pro is here. Right click on a name and select the connect option. Here's my AirPods Pro is connected. Now let's see all the settings. First is how to rename AirPods. Right click on AirPods name after pairing with Mac under the Bluetooth settings. Select the rename option and give a unique name and give a new name that clicks on the rename button. Second is how to manage AirPods settings. On paired AirPods name, we have another option in front of AirPods name. First is the microphone, this option allows us to set permission to use the microphone on left or right AirPods. Otherwise, keep it automatically, so we can use a microphone either left or right which is you are using. The ideal option is to automatically switch AirPods. The third is how to enable automatic ear detection. This option is combined with auto connect to this Mac while your AirPods in the ear. And the fourth option is connect to this Mac. Automatically option allows users to switch your AirPods from your other Apple device signed in with the same Apple ID to Mac. And the second option is when last connected to this Mac. Now the fifth setting is to use noise controller Siri activation. By press and hold on to the steam of the left or right AirPod. Here we can set Siri activation on for Mac while it's connected. And the second option is noise control as you know, here are three types of noise control, noise cancellation, transparency, and off. To switch between these three noise controls, press and hold on the stem of the AirPods case, and enjoy without open the settings. Number 6 tip is to manage AirPods from the control center on Mac. And the very interesting AirPods settings is the control center. Mac OS Big Sur or later Mac OS users can manage AirPods settings from the new control center like iOS. Click on the control center icon from the top right corner of the Mac screen. Now, click on the Bluetooth option on the network card, here's my AirPods is connected, so I can see the battery status of the left AirPod, right AirPods, and AirPods battery case. Also, we can turn on noise cancellation and transparency mode or turn off noise control. Here are other sound settings in the control center, select AirPods as output audio accessories. Also, manage output volume level. Number 7 AirPods setting on your Mac is audio balance, output audio level, and input microphone level from Bluetooth preference. Go to the Apple logo from the top Mac menu, and click on the system preferences option. Then click on the sound option. Select the output tab from the window, also select AirPod as output audio device, here's balance section, and set audio level on a slider. Keep it on center. And next slider is for the output audio level, which is the same as a volume level in the control center. Now, move to the last tab for input, select input device as AirPods. If your Mac is delivering low quality audio on calling, or recording time then you just have to increase from here. These are really important settings for AirPods on microphone. Hope you get the important tips and settings in this video, so thumbs up and subscribe for more updates. Also, comment on me to get more help from us.